Hello my scrappy friends, it is Jess here from the Scrappy Sisters and thank you for joining me for a Kidholics Kids Design Team Layout. So today is day 28 of Christy's Beautiful Life's 30 Days of Sketches and this sketch is designed by Bev Lewis. Uh, I really loved the hexagons in this uh, design and I utilized those as well. I cut myself a template um, just from a piece of cardstock. I just eyeballed it and cut it myself. Um, and after I'd cut each sort of size of hexagon, I just trimmed it down to cut the next size. And I ended up with, I think, four different sizes of hexagons to work with. And I really made the smiley face paper shine because this layout is not about a birthday party. It is about a play date. So I am not using the happy birthday things. I am using just the everyday life things. So I really loved these happy smiley faces because that is how the boys felt about their soccer play date. So I also used a Vicky Booten pre-made background. I, I am just embracing the crazy. I actually messaged it to my sister and said, is this a bit too much? And she's like, no, I love it. It's totally crazy, but let's just roll with it. So I did. It does take me a little bit of time to stick on all of these um, hexagons, but it's worth it when I get to the end. They are also having a soccer play date, so hexagons are kind of fun because they're that initial shape you think of when you think of a soccer ball. I'm trying to think in my head though if soccer balls actually are hexagons or if they're pentagons. Either way, we think of a soccer ball when we think about shapes in this similar style. Oh, hang on, I drew a soccer ball up there. How many lines does it have? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I thought it did. Um, so when we get to it, we are nowhere near there yet, but I'm just going to talk about it anyway. In the ephemera pack, there's this super cute monkey who is holding a present above his head. And I just thought it was perfect for this layout because the boys are cheeky monkeys and where he's holding the present, that would work so perfectly to put a soccer ball. So I cut the present off the monkey and just traced around a circle, draw around a circle and cut it out. I was going to use a flare button, but I just didn't have one that was a stereotypical soccer ball. And I certainly could have just used any old flare button, but I felt like it wouldn't have the same feeling to it. So I ended up using my black pen and just drawing on the pentagons and it looked okay. You definitely could tell it was a soccer ball and that was what I was going for. Then I decided I would try using some Nuvo to colour in the black pentagons and I loved it. I thought it looked so good with the Nuvo colouring in those pentagons. I was like, yes, this is the bomb. This is it. Um, and then I was too impatient to let the black dry completely. So I went on in with the white. Now, of course, that was a big mistake because the white and the black kind of blended together a little bit like a marble effect. But I'm embracing it. I love, I love the soccer ball. I think it turned out so well and it looks so cute with the monkey holding it that I'm really happy with the way it came together. Then I decided to use the clouds from the ephemera pack because why not? They are so happy. They're out in the sunshine having a beautiful day. It is about a fabulous day. So let's pop those on. I just used the last two pieces of floral that I had left in the kit as well, uh, just to add a little accent into where those embellishment clusters are. And I think it came together really, really well. You can see I used the title Happy Day because they were so happy and they just had the best time. Um, and I really love the way this all came together. You will notice that I am sticking down the vellum with my ATG gun today because my wet glue, my PVA glue was not my friend last time and it did not go well. I do go a little bit crazy with the ephemera dots, but it's fun. I like it. Then a few gold splatters and we are done. So here is my finished layout with my close-ups. I'm really happy with the way this one pulled together. I love all those little smiley faces. Um, it just works. You know, there's so much yellow happening in the photos as well. So it just works. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed uh, this month's kit from Kidaholics Kits. And I cannot wait to see you all again next month.